plenty of time with Leon, uh, famously at Smash and Splash, defeating Cosmos yeah. decisively. So we see that Bowser definitely does have some sauce in this matchup. Here we go, game one on Stadium. Because I'm pretty sure Inkling like can't jab Bowser because he'll he'll just tough guy right through it and get any punish. Yeah, one of uh, one of Inkling's big moves is his rapid jab. Uh, <laughs> that move. Yeah, the Seabass was determined to get in there. Yeah, this ink man, it's gonna allow damage to pile up. Already got him to almost 80 percent. For sure, but like three Seabass hits and it's almost even. Yeah, look at that. Oh well. Uh -oh. Ooh, Ooh catching the move. It's not gonna be enough though. Bowser's a heavy boy. Ooh, nice low recovery there. Uh, his up is deceptively, uh, deceptively good vertically. Ooh, great punish though on the on the greedy down air. Mm -hmm. Yep. Seabass is gonna have to avoid that because uh, I know he likes doing that against a lot of people. Because most people will get poked by the uh, second hit. Yeah, true. Um, but he can't afford to do that against Fanfu. Fanfu is showing already that uh, he knows exactly what to do. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> He hit him with the no you. It's my jab. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. And there you go. We were just saying. I like that. No charge, just, yep, get, just get him, him out, out of there. Next stock. Yeah, that's the utilitarian shield breaks right there. Yep. Uh oh. Yeah, covering space with the splat bomb. <laughs> Wanted a big read there. And man, look at this percent. Already got the lead. Ooh, nice. Good, Good reaction from Seabass. Yeah, that's oh. going to be so much damage. Wow, Andy two frames again. Mm -hmm. We'll finally get in there, but man, what a, what a, it was like 80% there. Yeah, it was crazy, yeah. And look at him, Seabass just jumping over on the side, you know. Again, just so willing to do the vision game. Yeah, can't be caught up shielding on the ledge. Get up side B is like almost unreactable. Yeah, Bowser's really anti, anti-meta uh, yeah. in this game. It's, it's so interesting to see because a lot of characters can just shield at ledge mm -hmm. and they're, they're ledge trapped. Right, um, exactly. But Bowser just kind of has an answer for that. And wow, goes yeah. so mm -hmm. deep for it. Great job <laughs> for Bamfu to turn that around. And I like that until such good range on it. And it'll definitely kill at this percent. Oh my goodness. Just throws that enough tilt in the wrong direction <laughs> just to bait him over so they can right. go in the right direction. He said, you thought. Oh, Ooh, and that fair killing from coast to coast. Dude. Yep. Uh oh. Around the world. Yeah, that's going to be enough. He had a shield. 15%. Yeah, a lot of his quick moves are just some, uh, some big Ooh. burst damage, man. 15% on the up B, 22% on that command grab. Not true, but Fanfu starting a combo here. Doesn't quite get the follow-up back there that he wanted. Oops. Now them. Neither of them wants to commit. Seabass running in with the Nair, finding it. Oh, no jump. This yeah, he's got to work. Follow up. Wow, just back that, with him. Yeah, that was uh, that was a great read from Seabass, man. He, he seems like he's in his head right now, oh man. Wow. Yeah, Seabass is just ledge coverage. And even like ledge coverage when he's on stage and like getting back two stage from ledge has just been phenomenal that whole game. Yeah, anytime someone's off stage, man, Seabass is scheming. <laughs> yeah, he's plotting. That, that was a great game one for him. Yeah, so true. Oh, he's and got the comfy fit and everything. He's, he's ready. He's, he's ready. Riding. <laughs> And even then, it was still a pretty close game. It was last stock, you know, he was at like 50-ish percent. Yeah, which but it just felt like on that last stock, he had Fanfu in his mm -hmm. corner. Mm -hmm. And I know uh, Fanfu has been training up the ZSS, but gonna stick it out with Inkling. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't see, I, I don't see him pulling up the ZSS in this set just because. Uh, I mean, Inkling still has a ton of things he can do against Bowser, uh, and, and it's 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 less so that uh, the, he's losing the matchup. It's more that he's losing the mental game against Seabass. Yeah, for sure. At least on the ledge, he's just getting hit with every mix-up. But you know, props to Seabass for you know call, making every right call at the ledge here. Oh yeah. But now, Fanfu starting off really strong. Not gonna need a side B. Mm. That's the second time he's tried for that. And it's a good option if your opponent's uh, trying to land with moves a lot, because it's mm. got uh, invincibility on the top. So, just a call out. And again, the, the risk reward ratio is pretty good, because, you know, if he got like the read he wanted, it might have been the stock. And if not, you know, he didn't really get punished too hard, so. Yeah. It's also just the intimidation that Bowser just oozes. Oh, yeah. That's unfortunate. Mm -hmm. The ink bomb is going to give him out there. Oh, my goodness. He read the Fort Glory roll. Fanfu not biting. <laughs> he really did, man. <laughs> And uh, 
that's one of the things that uh is gonna oh take advantage of the offstage goodness. game. And wow, what a way to turn it around in this game too. So blinking you miss it, quick is zero to death. Fair getting the trip, and suddenly man, Fanfu just in complete control this game too. Yeah, CBS is gonna need, uh, need a couple of big reads here because he still needs to take this first stock, right? He start going off stage. And that's yeah. uh that's where he can kind of punish you. Ooh, but again. Down to coverage. Yeah, it's such a good option because he, he snaps ledge. Uh, right. And he, and he has the option. He, he'll either kill it. Oh, that's going to be super sad. Yeah, 37 just from the fire breath. That's going to spike. Not going to do it, though. Yeah, oh, it's, my it's a pretty weak spike hitbox. True. Deceptively so because you feel like it'd be like super. Oh, oh yeah. Wanted it again, and he jumped from ledge again. He yeah. Just, he, he just did it a little uh, too late there that time. Mm. Ooh, he keeps Ooh. down airing on shield. I wonder if he's trying to condition him to shield underneath him. Ooh, so then he'll come up with the side beat. Yeah. Ooh. It's also risky because, uh, of course, Bowser's down there does have a landing hitbox. And yeah, got him in charge, in. Might have been a missing point. Oh, yeah. you gotta get a move out there because now they're at even percent. I mean, he's still got a stock lead. Throw back down smash. Touch. All right, and 124 on Bowser. Low key, not even kill percent. Might yeah. be booyah percent, though, with no rage. Certainly now, I think. But, uh, oh. Yeah, he went for the grab. He might be a Booyah percent, but now Seabass knows he's got to play anti grab. Oh, I like that. <gasps> Just a quick fire breath to rack up some damage and bait uh, an, an unsafe approach. Oh, Fanfu might think, have dropped it. Yeah, I think he dropped it because I think that was uh, proper Booyah percent. Oh. I, know, I know super heavies mostly uh, have a pretty wide range. But man, what a way for this to turn around on him. Right now, this is so scary. Both players at kill percent suddenly. Oh, and yep, he'll still be in range, and that'll and be Fanfu taking it. Yeah, even with that little bit of rage Fanfu has, still a good at that. Bowser, of course, has one of the biggest uh, ranges in the game for Booyah. Yeah, him and DDD are both way up there. Yeah. Yeah, great job. Great composure from Fanfu, man. And when, you, yeah. when you see your opponent running back uh, a 3-1 to one lead, right. the pressure, like, it, it's, it's, it's crazy how much the pressure shifts onto you to not get reversed. Exactly. Because, yeah, exactly how you said it. You hit the nail on the head. You needed that so badly. Because imagine how it must feel to zero to death your opponent and then lose that game, you know? Yeah. Yeah, that was, uh, that was so, so important for Fanfu. And even then, like, I feel like he doesn't really have too much momentum, you know, but... Yeah, I mean, Seabass can definitely uh, come away from that game thinking, like, you know, I brought it back. Exactly. I, I made the most of it. Right, because on Seabass, then, he's like, man, I got zero to death and still brought it back last hit. Yeah, Fanfu's just going to have to come with something a little different every game. Ooh, good landing there. That Nair gonna get punished later. Yeah, Nair, despite having a great combo game, he does actually have a fair amount of landing legs, so it's very punishable on him. I'm sure that fair hitting him from like the back or yeah, middle. Man. The hitbox of that move is insane. Yeah. Ooh, nice combo, get him up to 90. Not quite a roller kill percent yet, but uh, I mean, if you don't yeah. match out, then yeah, it <laughs> yeah, is. Come on, yeah, come on, see, you Push the buttons, man. You should not have done from that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I know you're the patient type. You gotta, you gotta right. match there. He's just vibing in the ground. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do me. <laughs> For sure. Ooh. That down tilt gonna do. Uh, I gotta put a blade off stage. And down tilt is really good at uh, catching two frames, but so is F tilt because like the headbox fingers and F tilt would kill. So I would like to see Seabass go for a few more F tilts. Yeah, I wonder if he just prefers timing out down tilt. Um, yeah, true. I don't Comfort, know. You know, it was always a big part of it. I like the aggressive landing with the fair there. Ooh, and a great job just jumping up. Um, oh, up to gonna do it. Yeah, it covers so much. Ooh, wondering fair. Fanfu up by a lot of percent. Ooh, beautiful. I thought Fanfu was gonna go for the down smash there. Maybe that's what Seabass was scouting too. Yeah, see? Yeah, there it is. But Fanfu patient with the shield. Yeah, I think he's trying to do his best to just not pick any punishable options. I think he wants to play as safe as possible here. Oh, true. Because Bowser can turn anything into a kill. Right. He's so good at just making the best of a bad situation. We're gonna see the ooh, fading back with the fair. Yeah, it's good bait from Seabass. Oh. 
Seabass giving him stage. Ooh, great patience from Fanfu, saving that jump, saving that back air. Uh, take out that second stock. Right, very, very good edge guard. Oh, no. Man, he's gonna get so much oh mileage off that spot yeah. dodge command grab. And I love these short hops while he, uh, while he waits for his pawn to respawn, just shaking the screen. Way back though, waits a little bit before it goes to the ledge. Oh my goodness, it's completely hit through the splat bomb. Yeah, just covers so much space. Seabass trying to get in there, having some difficulty this last stock, but rushing with the fair. Oh, good shield. Like pivotal shield. That would have been the game. Yeah. Great tomahawk. Uh oh. Yeah, hopefully Fanfu can't start fishing for it. Good guy to tag that time. Seabass not able to stop it in time. Yeah, oh, that's oh that it. should be it. Right, yeah, Fanfu that, takes game three. Because that time he didn't even match, and he was at 130, and he, like, barely died. So the other time, like, man, like, again, Seabass, he, he needs to mash out of those rollers, you know? Yeah. It sucks having to mash. I think mashing is kind of a silly... Mechanic. Yeah, so I have to do, you know. Yeah, I've seen, I've, I've seen the tweets. <laughs> yeah, yes sir. <laughs> but man, at the end of the day, that's the game we play, you know. Yeah. And you don't want to be dying as Bowser, like at like ninety percent to a roller, F smash, you know. <laughs> yeah, imagine, imagine doing that. Right? Yeah. Couldn't be me. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful switch here. Mm, I yeah, I wonder. Yeah, see, that's a wacky guy. You never know what that man is thinking. But I know he plays with his heart. Yeah, I think we'd love to see it. Yeah, we're gonna stick right. with the tried and true. Yeah, switch off the color a bit though. The pink Bowser. What a weird color. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> game four here on battlefield. I love that. I, I I don't know. I just I really like the, just the concept of creating space with that bomb. This is very interesting to me. I don't know. I know, that, make, that makes sense. You, I mean, you play good. You know? you, yeah, I love that type of play, you know? Trying to condition them to go to certain places and to do different things. Yeah, so interesting. To me, anyway. Oh, yeah. Lesser minds might think it's boring. Nah, I'm playing. <laughs> Small Ooh. brains don't understand why <laughs> yeah. I spam Gordo. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Man, there's just a lot of dance going on so far. Ooh, up to up. Up air. <laughs> Definitely not a true combo, but you know, fan food is not ready for it. <laughs> so scary, dude. Yeah, great patience on ledge though, waiting until he commits to his option. Yeah, and that platform gonna save fan food from that downer here. Running low on ink. He's gotta find some space, which is hard because Bowser is like he's a rushdown character for something. He is so fast, you know. Oh, if he yeah. sees you charging ink, he can just run over there, side be you. Probably even dash attack, good burst option. Ooh, yeah. Unfortunate SD there. Yeah, Seabass tried to fade away, but too much. Gonna cost him a stock there. And again, even if Fanfu hit the fair, like, Seabass probably would have still lived, you know? Yeah. Just because Bowser is so heavy, so. Yeah, I like not, not going for the rapid jab, knowing that Bowser could have just destroyed him, so. Beautiful. That was, oh, oh that was goodness. Mwah. Mwah, mwah. Yes, even just reacting to, like, the direction he rolled with the turnaround side B. Oh. Perfect uh, coverage from Seabass there. Yeah, it looks like he had just about everything covered. Just needed to react. True. And yeah, finding the fuse up tilts. Whoa. <laughs> all right, it was all bait. <laughs> now Fanfu trailing here. Yeah, the stage's been doing uh, doing some work for both players so far. Fanfu's got a couple combos off the <gasps> platforms and wow, just the call out. Oh my god. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't know if Fanfu tried to be aggressive and go above ledge, but either way, just getting caught up. Yeah, I know uh, CS a couple of times has uh, has sat there breathing fire ledge and he's gotten punished for it. Uh -huh. I'm wondering if Fanfu might have just kind of uh, mixed up his auction and thought he was going to go for the fire again. True. Cool. Finding the down smash there. I like the option to recover mm -hmm. high. No, he's not going to die to anything yet. Yeah, I got the sour spot of the up smash. Charging up his ink there. <laughs> I think you he just wanted to be reverse the fire there. Maybe. Or, you know, <laughs> just creating a little wall there. A little waterfall. Lava fall. Uh-oh. Oh. Yeah, that can't miss text. True. That could have been a jab block. That could have been so much worse for Fan <gasps> Ooh. Oh, wow. Yeah, he just, anyway. yeah, he just knew the fire was going to have to uh, run out eventually. Yeah, oh, and a quick taunt there. Out. 
Hello, fan food. Yeah. You're, you're down 72%. Yeah. <laughs> right, now he's got to win this, like, bro. Yeah. You look stupid. Like, uh oh. Uh oh, uh, fan food. Nah. Now you let's see it. Oh, oh buddy. Fan food. Oh, no. Good DI there. He's still alive, but that next one will be death for yeah, him. So he needs to be so really hard. careful. Yeah, he can't be oh. caught. Wow, he went nowhere. <laughs> yeah, dude, he got hit by the spike hit bugs. Yeah. I mean, still, I think it was more just about Seabass saying, yeah, I got the read. And yeah, yeah he'll get the grab too. So let's keep those taunts in the pocket, my friend. We're going to game five. Wow. Bold option from FanFu, I guess, trying to trying to get in his head a bit. Mm -hmm. uh, but just feel himself, but... Yeah, but that backfire. <laughs> <laughs> the way not working out. Shibas talking to the crowd a bit. He's uh, like, you see that? You see what he's trying to do? <laughs> <laughs> Shaking his head. He said, I can't believe <laughs> this man tried to talk on me. That's crazy, you know? <laughs> uh, you don't have to see it. Yeah. Of course, I'm we're still going to see Bowser wrangling game five. Can't yeah. see the stage, but... I'm glad, uh... I always think it. Hello? Oh. Oh. Might have just been checking this phone or something. Yeah, tried and true. England versus Bowser. Game five in the set. A lot of back and forth. A lot of adaptations. Yeah, I'm glad we're seeing this go to game five. I feel like both these players are really good at getting into their opponent's head. Ooh, yeah. Oh, and wow. Just answering straight out. Big combo. Great DI out from Seabass, exactly, though. Yeah. Avoided if, it this time. Right. If he didn't fade out, that would have just been the stock. Just clean. And even then, this is still trouble. Yeah, those two frames. Uh, Two frames can mean a lot. I like the further left. Just yeah. Kind of dissuade any uh, any aggressive options. Both people missing uh, missing the grabs there. Ooh, we're finding that lingering fair hitbox. Nice delayed up B. It's good to see that he knows like the exact height that he can go with up B. Ooh, and he, here's where the damage racks up. Not not necessarily combos, just Bowser keeping his opponent in disadvantage. Right, just using, using straight hits. Yeah, just using, mm -hmm. like, damage and fear. Right. The intimidation, one of Bowser's, like, biggest strengths. Yeah, it's, above all. it's so interesting that they've designed a character that literally does use fear. Yeah, right? Uh-oh. <gasps> Tomahawk Ooh, but, almost yeah. landed there. This time, fan for reacting to it. Not gonna oh, kill him. Wow, I thought he was at the percent for it. Yeah, same. Even with that little bit of rage. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Just punches the roller right out of his hands. <sighs> oh, he wanted that all there. Yeah. That would have been untackable, too. Oh, definitely so. That was just back here. One of the strongest in the game. Ooh. And he yeah. had to get hit by that slap off. <gasps> but he it. saved his jump the whole time. That was so smart from him. He'll finally lose the stock there, but uh, still, yeah. good job. Just kind of uh, living as long as he could. Right. There's only so much you can do with such a limited recovery. But Seabass making the most of that stock, I would say. This fourth throw might do it. Ooh. Not quite yet. Almost. Next one, maybe. Oh, and a great punisher. That's the first time that uh, I've seen Fanfu really roll from ledge and get punished for it. Yeah. So great job from Seabass getting the read there. Ooh, oh, my he is God. dancing, bro. Dude, he is running around right. on him right now. Fanfu needs to get a bit more aggressive, I think. <gasps> he's getting. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just so scared every time, man. <laughs> <laughs> he's just doing it. I think he's just doing it to get in his head now. He says, I don't need to taunt. I'll just, I'll just move on you. For sure. Oh. Ooh, oh, out of shield. Yeah. Wow, and now the fire breath. And he finds his way around oh it and just armors right through the jab. jab and look, he does another one. He says, this is what you died to. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Learn it. Learn it for next stop. For real. Yeah, as we said, Inkling cannot jab Bowser. Usually get up jab is a very good option because it, it, you know, it's very fast and does so much damage. But versus Bowser, you know, that armor will just, just negate it. Yeah, that was great awareness from Seabass too for that. Man, this is just, yeah, like... I, I believe in momentum. Oh, um, very, much. very much. And I think momentum is solidly in CBS's favor right now. Like he's just waiting. He's yeah. just sitting there. He's not even breathing fire anymore. He's just like, I know what I want to do. He wants that. He uh -huh. wants to break a shield. Mm -hmm. This man wants to break a shield and break someone's heart right now. Oh. <laughs> and yeah, Fanfu out of ink. He's got to find some time to recharge. Yeah, he's got to do it there. It sucks because he has stage control. He has advantage, but he needs that ink. Oh and once goodness. again, just punching straight through that great right. job. Just, said, <laughs> no. just jabbing that ledge. And of course, it is working. He is up by so much, but you don't want to get cocky. You know, you want to finish the job. Yeah. Of course, Bowser is going to live a very long time, but we've seen Fanfu's uh, combo potential. You don't want to give him another chance. 
Up tilt's gonna, gonna do off. it. Mm -hmm. And next big hit could mean death for either player here. And the back air will trade, and that'll be Seabass taking it in game five. And a dominant game five, by the way. Yeah. He just ran away with it. And even then, he was just kind of not. It's not even playing with his food as much as like just the intimidation.